If you are a beginner raw feeder, this video is for you. In this video, we are going to be breaking down the three beginner ways we can introduce raw food into your dog's life. Now, I know the process might be daunting and you might be very new to this thing. However, we are going to address how you can switch from kibble to raw with minimal disruption and the benefits of raw are absolutely wonderful. Now, before we get into the three different methods to switch to raw, I want you to think about protein and how lean something is. Let me give you an example. If you eat something like lamb or if you eat something like beef, those meats are going to be richer and arguably harder to digest than something like turkey or chicken. So if your dog is new to raw food, the first thing I want you to do is think about lean protein sources. Something like chicken or turkey or anything fish would be very good. Why? They are easily digestible. So it is very likely, it is more likely that your dog will take to chicken a lot better than they will take to something a bit more rich. Now, having said that, the first method I want to tell you about is the fresh in the morning and kibble at night. If you want to do a transition from kibble to raw, the worst thing you can do, in my opinion, is mix the two. So if you are going to gradually transition your dog from kibble to raw, maybe give raw in the morning and kibble at night. By feeding raw in the morning, we are creating a bit of a habit. Your dog will be a bit hungrier than normal after having slept all night, and maybe at night after work, it's a bit easier for you to put kibble down for your dog to eat. So if you feed raw in the morning and kibble at night, that can be your first way to switch in over to raw. After maybe a few days, four days to a week, it would be beneficial for your dog to be completely switched over to raw and to give your dog 100% of their diet in raw dog food. The second way we are going to talk about is the green beef tripe method. Now, beef green tripe is the nutrient-rich stomach lining of an animal, and it is indeed packed with nutrients that will help your pet's health. The biggest benefit of green beef tripe is that it is absolutely jam-packed with digestive enzymes and probiotics that will improve your dog's gut and improve their digestive system. So if you think about it, we are transitioning your dog from kibble, which is processed, to raw dog food, which is fresh food. And your dog's digestive enzymes might not be very well adept to coping with this new diet that you are presenting your dog. And because raw is fresh, and we are transitioning from something like kibble, which is processed, your dog's gut might need a period of adaptation. So with this second method, I want you to feed boneless green tripe for the first week only. By feeding boneless beef tripe, we are going to be boosting our dog's gut and adapting our dog's gut and its bacteria in order for us to then transition 100% to raw dog food. So by starting with green beef tripe, we are boosting and preparing our dog's good bacteria so that they can cope better with raw food. And the third method we are going to talk about is a straight swap. Now in 99% of cases that we encounter, a quick straight swap is the absolute best whenever it comes to raw food. Simply run down your bag of kibble and introduce raw dog food straight away. 
in the next meal and from the next meal onwards, your dog is very likely to be biologically adapt and adept to breaking down all the enzymes and the food you are providing. Your dog is more likely to prefer the moisture and the freshness of the food, so maybe a straight swap is best for you. Now, do not overthink it. Put the food down and let its magic happen. It is very likely, again, that your dog will cope very well with a straight swap. Now, even then, raw food can be a bit daunting and a bit new. The one piece of advice I can give you is that millions of people do this. If you educate yourself onto a bath diet or a biologically appropriate diet, it is very likely that your dog is going to thrive and your dog is going to do really, really well on fresh food. Fresh doesn't have anything in common with kibble. Fresh food is absolutely wonderful, it's biologically appropriate, and it's arguably the best thing you can do for your dog. Now remember that raw dog food has to suit your lifestyle, so make sure you have the time, the effort, and the resources to provide and procure quality raw dog food for your dog try not to cut any corners and try to do it by the book. Try to follow a simple but effective diet and your dog will be absolutely thriving. And let me tell you, if you are still deciding and pondering over which brand of raw dog food is best for your dog, in this video here, I have put a list of some of my favorite brands to which I am not affiliated with, but I think it's a very good starting point for you to learn more about raw dog food. And so watch this video next and I'll see you in the next one.